start. So make sure you prepare yourself a glass of water. Again, same as yesterday, we're gonna use five liter bottle filled with water. I have here two kinds of chickpeas. So half my kitchen is here. You're joking. And for one of the exercises, okay? So cool. We do a quick, quick warm up. You can start with kneeling position. So straighten your back and start to rotate your shoulders, shoulders to the back. Exhale. Three, two, and one. And lift your arms all the way up and down over the head, warming up your shoulders. Three, two, and one. Let's extend your arms to the side and pull. Four, three, two, and one, and give me a deep breath in, exhale out, and again start rotating the shoulders to the back, squeezing both shoulder blades together. Four, three, two, and one, and again up and down. Side and pulse. Keep your posture right. Okay, so head in line with your spine. Three, two, and one. And let's pre stretch the triceps. So try and reach your opposite hand just be behind you into pre stretch. Don't be scared if one of your side is a little better than the other. It's pretty normal. Unless you have a big difference in between, yeah? Then it means that you have a slight, or maybe a little bit bigger than usually um, muscle disbalance. Cool, so we're gonna start with body weight only. 10 and 10, 10 push-ups by 10 push-ups, okay? Pay attention on my elbows. We're gonna do three sets, one after the other with no break, then we're gonna take a quick sip of water and go straight to bicep and tricep, okay? So get ready. On your knees, keep your elbows really close to your ribcage. Exhale. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And pay attention on my elbows. Wider stand, so your arms are much wider than for the previous exercise. We go straight to the chest push up. Exhaling all the way up, keep that belly button in, your body nice and straight. Last three, two, and one. Stretch, sit back, extend your arms, inhale, exhale, we go again. One of my favorite concepts, yeah, where it is uh, body weight exercises for a lot of repetitions, you fatigue the muscles. Stretch. Ooh. 
Now, gentlemen, or guys, if you do an exercise with me, I want to pay attention, you are staying on your toes. Yes? Now, last set. Now, if I fail, I fail. <laughs> Very hard. A nice and wide stand. Are you ready? Ten push ups. Push-ups in total with no break. That is tough. Quick sip of water. Deep inhale, exhale. And for this one, we're going to need a bottle. So shoulders and biceps. We're going to start in kneeling position with the biceps first. Breathe in, breathe out. On the couch. Hold it halfway. Five, four, three, two, and one. Relax. Again, three sets, and we're going for the shoulders, frontal raise. And ten. Well done. Shake it off. We go for another two sets. I can already feel it on my arms. It's a short class, 20 seconds, sorry, 20 minutes. So, well, it's pretty intense. Let's go again for the bicep. Non stop and muscle fatigue. So, Obviously, for people who are looking to bulk up and grow up muscle tissue significantly, it wouldn't be a very good idea. But for fitness level, maintenance and increase, it's perfect. Last one. Ready? Halfway. Hold. bigger bottles, whichever. Halfway. Now my shoulders are burning. Oh. Frontal shoulder. Ten. Oh. 
people walking. Well done. Now, good news are, arms are pretty much done. We're just gonna do one more exercise for the back of the shoulders and the back, and a little bit for the chest, and that's about it. So if you're looking for the cardio, after this 20 minute upper body workout, you can go for a walk. Now, okay, kneeling or half standing. So we have in a squat position. Take the bottle in front of you, keep your head in line, which is fine. Keep your elbows really close to your ribcage, row, exhale. Now don't forget to squeeze both shoulder blades together. If you have a mirror at home, have a look in the mirror and make sure you're in my position. I mean, make sure you are. A little bit more repetitions for the back. The back is the biggest muscle of your body. So don't be afraid to do more or do heavier. Three, two, and one. Brilliant. Drop the bottle. Crop your pants. Yes, yes. Squeeze. Both shoulder blades together. Stay in the same position. We're going to pulse it there for 12. Seven. Exhale. Three, two, and one. Relax. Now, let's go straight again. Two more sets. If you feel uncomfortable, uncomfortable feeling on your lower back, engage your core. What do I mean by engaging my core is basically squeezing your belly button in as you were trying to fit into your jeans that no longer fit. Three, two, one, drop. You ready? All the way behind. Hold. Twelve. Exhale. Four. Three, two. Breathe out, one. One more set. Are you ready? Let's go. Touching, hold it there, slowly extend. Let's drop. Now, holding the positions. My legs getting tired. Yeah, because they hold more my body weight. Stabilize the position. Ready? Stand. If you have one liter of bottles, will be probably more beneficial. Yeah, because I can feel a bit not enough weight there. Pulse. Unusual grief. 
and I can feel my chest working. All of the pectorials, pectorials muscles, opposite to you when you do it with a stable weight of the dumbbell. Okay, let's swap. Look at this, crazy! Whew. Oh, that happens to be better. Okay, single arm chest press with a bottle. Unstable weight makes such a massive difference. Such a massive difference. Two more reps. Whew. One more. Excellent. Now, we are back kneeling. Very quick. Let's grab again the cans. Yes? Arms to the side. Your elbow is slightly naturally bended. Okay? We're going to do a few rotations. Direction really doesn't matter. Keep your back super straight. Yes? Yes? We're going to rotate to the time opposite two repetitions. Again, to fatigue the muscle. Three. Two. And one. Right now, two more sets. I don't know how my arms gonna respond again for this chest press. Unique chest press we just discovered. Thank you, lockdown. Yeah, I probably will never be <laughs> trying anything like that in the gym. It's better for the second set. I kind of know what to expect. Now, I want to pay attention. This is the first time I'm doing that kind of chest press, okay? Previously, my weight never was filled with the water, I'll be honest. It was just the metal. <laughs> Two more. Push. One more. Excellent. I feel it on the whole my arm and the chest together. So. Now, what kind of unstable weight you can take? You can take your cat, you can take your dog, you can take your partner, you can take your child. Whichever you can lift, go for it. Just be careful. Don't overlock your elbows. One more. We made it. Now, slowly up. Shoulders again. Rotations. Ready? Keep your back straight. Naturally, the elbows here. Yeah? Don't keep them too straight. Three, two, and one. Woo! Relax. Last set. Now, I want to apologize. One seat, I promise. Now, last set. We do quick stretch. We are done. I actually really can feel it. Now, ready? Oh, I need a spot. Oops. Now, ready? I also recommend to start with the weakest arm. It's not the case with me right now. Start with the right just by the like as a habit. But if you feel you have a weaker part, a weaker side, always start with the weaker side. Oh my god. My arms are literally giving up. One more. There is always room for one more, isn't it? Now. Let's go. Exhale. Exhale up. Exhale up. One more. 
I'll just put it with my arms. Look, 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 she. Crazy. Last, last exercise. We're done. Good stretch. We finished. Okay. Now, all the way to the side. Let's do standing. Yeah. Or kneeling. Full kneeling. Absolutely doesn't matter, you man, woman, makes no difference um, because I think upper body is rather preference by the age so you rather meet more people um, between men who would be interested to do upper body rather than women uh, they kind of don't think it's necessary or they're afraid to get big shoulders or any sort of uh, uh, unrealistic excuse that people can come up with but it's actually very important to keep your body balanced which means each group of muscle needs to be trained every week okay let's open up the chest the upper body strength also um, helps keep your all organs in place which is very important as well the posture the stronger the core the more likely you are when you're in a sitting working position on any sort of the desk uh, you're less prone to injuries and bad postures and all these kind of sort of the things so it's very very important Relax. Now, last one. Stand your arms to the front, roll your back to the front, lengthen your spine, try to relax your back. Whew. That was good. That is really, really good. I think it's a very, very good workout for the upper body. Um, and luck with women is not an issue. So as you can see, you literally can heal yourself with like 5% of your kitchen storage. So I uh, hope to see you tomorrow at 10 o'clock for bumps and tongues. So then we definitely get a full body workout during the week. And I promise to come back, come back to the subject why I don't like exercising every day. Because Number one, I never met a person in my life, doesn't matter how they love fitness or even if they would be a professional athlete or bikini athlete or anything like that, um, that would consistently exercise six, seven times per week and never ever tell that, oh, I think that I need a break. But the break that they need is not necessarily for their body, but they need it psychologically. So I believe in variety, variety is the spice of life. So it's important to invest three to four hours of training a week and then invest the rest of your time to the other things and people who are liking of your attention, etc, etc. And this is how you keep the balanced life that you actually can stick with and don't, don't need as much break, yeah? Anyway, we can talk about that at some other time, or you can private message me if you have more questions. So, uh, after this video, more videos are going to be uh, available on my YouTube channel. Uh, some of my friends who follow me on Facebook as well, you can scroll down and see a lot of last week's and previous week's videos uploaded on my wall. So you can always scroll down and wish them on and training on your own pace. It's totally fine. Anyway, thank you so much for your attention. I can talk forever. Thank you so much for your attention. Have a good day. I'll see you tomorrow.